What's up, What's you up, guys? guys? Dude, welcome to GV Kids Weekend. Super excited to be here. I am too. And uh, I'm actually a little bit chilly, Miss Korea. Chilly? Yeah, because I mean, I feel like winter's kind of here. We're in November, and winter. it's been a little cold out recently. Oh, uh, this is not winter. No, this no. isn't winter. Oh, okay, I'm gonna live in Missouri, and then you'll experience winter. Okay, all right, Mr. well, David. all right, well, well, guys, we have a super fun time for you guys today. But first, we gotta do something. Yeah, we need to pray. We gotta pray. Miss Korea, why don't you pray? All right, bow your heads, close your eyes. Dear God, thank you so much for um, being with us wherever we are. Um, thank you for just this season. Help us to um, praise you no matter what and help us to learn about you today. Amen. Amen. All right, guys, let's do it. What's up, you guys? Welcome to my Dude Tube channel. By the way, it's Pastor Jason here. We're gonna play a game called Unshakable. You know what's unshakable? A tree. A tree is unshakable. So I'm gonna, I'm going to climb this tree, and it's gonna be unshakable. All right, you guys ready? We're gonna play this game. You guys ready? Three, two, one. Let's go! Look at this tree. Look at it. Look at it. Oh my gosh, this tree! Oh, oh, oh what? What? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, guys, guys, you know, I guess the tree wasn't unshakable. That's crazy. I just fell off the tree. I guess the tree wasn't unshakable. But you know who's unshakable? God. You know, actually, this week, our big idea is we need to give praise to God and be unshakable because God is unshakable. It reminds me of our Bible verse. Our Bible verse is Psalm 156. Let everything that breathes sing praises to the Lord. Praise the Lord. I mean, just think about it. What is something you can give God praise for today? Well, guys, thanks for joining my YouTube channel. Unshakable is awesome. See you later. Peace. Hello and welcome to GV Kids News, where kids matter most. I'm Miss Korea. And I'm Leonard, filling in for Joe King. Hey, Miss Korea, Miss Korea. Hey, Leonard, what's up? Hey, uh, nothing much, doing well. Hey, um, I have a joke that Joe King told me to tell you. Can I tell you it? Yeah, we're ready for a joke. All right, all right, here we go. Okay. Um, how do you fix a broken pumpkin? How do you fix a broken pumpkin? Yeah, yeah. Um, tape. No. Okay, glue. Nope. All right, tell me. A pumpkin patch. A pumpkin <laughs> patch. Yeah. That's a good yeah. all joke, Leonard. Thanks, I really thanks, like yeah. It. it was a good one, yeah. Yeah, good job. Thanks. Well, Leonard. Yeah? October is over. Yeah, it so makes me sad because I, know. I got a lot of candy, though. You did? Yeah, Well, it was we, awesome. This past weekend, we actually had a lot of kids dressed up in costumes. That's right. So let's check out these pictures. Okay. Pretty cool costumes, Miss Korea. They were. They were so creative too. Yeah, I was a dinosaur. You were? Yeah. I, I, like I have that. like dinosaur like teeth and a tail. It was so cool. That is so cool. All right, well, right now we have Pastor David out in the field gonna tell us the weather. Pastor David! Uh th thanks, Leonard. It's uh it's a little cold out here, a little chilly. Uh back to you guys. Wow, Pastor David looks really cold out he there, Miss Korea. Yeah. All right, guys, well, it's time to worship. Come on, let's worship. Yeah! Oh, man, Miss Korea, that was some good news today. Well, Leonard. Yeah? I didn't want to embarrass you. Oh, okay. Well, I know. What happened? But you told the same joke that Joe King told. What? Two weeks ago. Are you kidding me? That's the one he told me to. Oh, 
I'm gonna have some he's, words with him. He's kind of a trickster. Yeah, he I, is. I think he's, he might have tricked you. He he tells a lot of jokes. I mean, that's probably why his name is Joe King, because he likes to yes. joke a lot. <sighs> All right, Miss Korea. Well, I'm out of here. Go okay. back to my trailer. Bye. All right, I'll see you later. <laughs> What's up guys, welcome to game time. Well, actually it's not really a game time as much as it is a, like a craft time that they can do at home. Okay. Yeah, so here's what you guys are gonna need. You guys are gonna need markers. Got them. You guys are gonna need paper. Paper. Any color. Any color. And okay. you'll need your hand. That's yeah. easy. Uh, if you got those three things, you can do the game craft today. Okay. All right, so choose your color, Miss Korea. All right, I'm gonna choose orange. Okay, and I'm gonna choose yellow for this one. Okay. I'm gonna take this one away. All right. And here's what you gotta do. You gotta choose a color paper, um, and then you choose a color of marker. So choose one. Got it. And choose blue. 
And then here's what you do. You're gonna take that marker and you're gonna put your hand on the paper, not like too far off so the hand is like off the paper. You want your hand to be like on the paper, just like that, so their whole hand's there. And then just kind of trace around your hand. All right, you're just gonna trace your hand. You're just gonna trace it, just like that. It kind of tickles as the marker goes around. <laughs> All right, so then once you have that, then you wanna, so you should have your hand. So you're gonna complete the bottom of the circle, just like that. There we go. All right, now okay. choose a different color. Mm, I'm gonna choose this one right here. And you're gonna draw in the middle there, you're gonna draw a wing, all right? So a like, a, like a wing, yeah. Like with some like feathers, yeah. Like so like, you know, like a, like a little wing. Okay. Yeah. I don't know, how? Yeah, like a, like a little wing, yeah, there sure. you go. All right, so that's my wing. Okay. Miss Korea, oh, I like her wing. Okay, and then, um, choose a different color. And then at the bottom here, we're gonna draw two feet. Now these feet are like, kind of like chicken feet, all right? So you're gonna draw like one line, and then the other three lines, and then another line, and the other three lines. Some of you guys already know what we're making. All right, so just like that. Just got little legs. And then up here, a uh, different color. Up here, you're going to draw a little eyeball on the thumb, like so. Okay. And then you're gonna grab another color. I like your colors. Thanks. And you're gonna draw a little beak. Oh, I don't want that color. Yeah, you're gonna draw a little beak there. Oh, but I guess he's orange, so, okay. Okay. And then lastly but not least, you can draw a little gobbly, a little gobble gobble at the bottom there. Not quite sure what it's called. I think it's called a gobble gobble. That sounds right. And you have a turkey. Now, Miss Korea, do you know why we made a turkey? I do not. It's well, I mean, it's Thanksgiving. It is soon. November 1st. Yeah. That means, that, oh, like November, in November. And most of you guys are watching this on, on November 1st. And that means that it's the month of Thanksgiving. Yes, and there's our little turkeys. Very nice. Hopefully nice. you guys are good at home too. Now, here's why we drew a turkey today, guys. We okay. are going to actually, on each of the feathers here, all right, each of the feathers on top here, we're gonna write something that we can praise God for or that Ooh. we're thankful for, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Because there's a lot of things that we can be thankful for to God, and, and we're just not gonna write one on each of the fingers, all right? So here we go, Miss Korea, Miss Korea, gonna do it. Go ahead and grab another color, Miss Korea. Let's go ahead. All right, something that I'm thankful for, for God is, um, I am super thankful that God um, made me. So I'm gonna put that God made me. Okay. One thing I am super thankful for is church. Ooh, that's a that good one. That we can have church wherever and that we're open. Yeah. So you can come here if you're comfortable. I like it, all right. Yeah? All right, next, um, I'm going to, I chose a different color. I don't know if you wanna choose a different color. You don't have to. I'm thankful for that, uh, I'm thankful that we get to um, read the Bible. I like the Bible a lot. I'm thankful for the Bible. Okay. I'm thankful for you. Oh, me? I put Pastor David. That's nice. Oh, me? A little old me? Yep. I'm also thankful for you, Miss Korea. So I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put my family, because you're my family. And you know, that, that little guy in there is my family because you know, Miss Korea's pregnant, so I'm gonna put my family. That was the thing I was gonna, I was gonna put baby. Little baby. Yep. And then, um, uh, I like to praise God for my last one right here. I like to praise God because um, he is super awesome. And I'm just gonna put, I'm just gonna put powerful. Okay, I'm putting my friends. I am thankful for my friends. I like it, Miss Korea. There we go. All right, and there is your Thanksgiving turkey. A little uh, little thankful, praising Thanksgiving turkey, guys. It's good for us to praise God in our lives because, you know, praising God is good. So That's true. Hopefully you guys turned out good. Send us a picture oh. at nextgenagvchristian.com. We'd love to see your turkeys. All right, well, let's go, uh, let's go, let's go have a turkey battle. How about that? Okay, sounds All right, fun. cool, yeah. Stop fighting!
Fang, stop fighting! It's not time for fighting, it's time to be thankful, because, well, it's November and it's Thanksgiving, guys. Do you guys agree? They agree. These are all thankful turkeys, um, even though uh, turkey fights are pretty fun. They uh, they have like all these thankfuls, like powerful, family, Bible, you know, made me, by a baby, friends, Pastor David, church, right? And I mean, it makes me think about how King David was really thankful to God as well. You know, in Psalms, Psalm 150 specifically, if you look at that Psalm, it says, we praise God for this, we praise God for that, praise God for this, and that, and that. And it talks about all these praises that uh, David made to God. And, and what that means is he just like was, thank you, God. He just kept saying, thank you, God. Thank you, God, for everything. Thank you for my life. Thank you for my family. Thank you for everything that you do, God. And you know, during this time, that's what we need to be unshakable. Now, what does it mean to be unshakable? It means that, you know, no matter what comes at us in life, that we don't move. We're just continuously relying and trusting in God. And being thankful is a huge part of that, guys. We have to be thankful to God and praise God for everything he does. Our verse this week actually comes out of Psalm 150, verse 6. It says this. Psalm 150, verse 6, it says this. It says, let everything that breathes sing praises to the Lord. Praise the Lord. So guys, in this season, during November, think about something that you can praise God for. Let's pray. Jesus, we thank you for everything in our lives. That we get to praise you for just things that you do for us and that you have done for us. And Lord, help us to be focused on you and be unshakable. We love you, Jesus. In your name we pray. Amen. All right, guys. Well, be nice, all right? Be nice. Be nice. Yeah. Good turkeys. Good turkeys. No fighting. No fighting. No fighting. No fighting. No fighting. No fighting. Go, go, go. Come on, go, go. Go, 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 go. Wow, Pastor David, that was such a good weekend. I know. It was an amazing weekend. I especially liked our turkeys and the I turkey fight. That was pretty good. Yeah. That was fun. Yeah. But, uh, I mean, really, I mean, what we're talking about this week is being unshakable. You That's know? true. We're learning that we need to give praise to God. That's right. And be unshakable because God's unshakable. Because God's unshakable, yeah. Our verse comes out of one uh, Psalm 150, verse 6, that sings this. Of everything that breathes gives praises to God. Praise the Lord. Wow. And we need to praise God in all the things that we do. No and so, what. Yeah, exactly. So, I have a question for you guys. Think about it. How can you praise God today? Man, Ms. Korea, there are so many things that we can give God praise for in our lives and be thankful for. I mean, that's huge. It's true. Yeah. Yeah, and when we're thankful, that helps us to focus more on God. And be unshakable. And be unshakable. That's right. All right, guys, well, we love you guys so much. We'll see you next week on GV Kids Weekend.